you guys, it's Megan, and today I wanted to start the vlog off <clears throat> like while doing my makeup um, because that's just what I wanted to do. And um, as I kind of alluded to at the end of my last vlog, things have not all been super great <laughs> lately. Um, and part of that has been because of my dating life and um, unfortunately that has come to an end um, and not because I wanted it to. <laughs> so that has been pretty like frustrating and just difficult and um literally i am so cursed around valentine's day because this is literally this day that i'm filming this is the exact day that i got dumped um in a different relationship and so this week like valentine's week is just not my week and um me and Alyssa were joking like next year when it's valentine's day or like valentine's week when uh we're living together like i am not leaving the house i am not talking to anyone like it is not safe for me because it's just cursed like i swear to god so um that has been weighing on me i guess and um yeah so that's kind of the main thing and then work has been a little like frustrating and just like a lot going on um so that doesn't help but i want this vlog to be like happy and I want to have a really great weekend because Alyssa's moving in tomorrow tonight me and my family are going out for a really really nice dinner um that like I paid for it's like a prefix like menu um so we're going to this really awesome local restaurant and I absolutely cannot wait so um that's to thank my parents and my sister for all of their help with me moving out and that has been like scheduled for like a month or so and um so I'm not gonna have like a Debbie Downer vlog don't worry but it is just part of what is going on with me so if I'm not like super super um peppy or something that definitely is part of it so um i told myself that i'm going to do my makeup today feel really like good um and like do what i can to make myself feel better with things that i can control because i can't control someone else's emotions reactions feelings like I just have to focus on myself and um, yeah so I am upset but I'm going to I guess try to make the best of it and today this is like totally random for you guys but I'm looking at my window and it's like my front uh, driveway and today is trash day and it is so windy um, and I don't see my trash can out there like I am terrified I have a meeting so I can't really like deal with it right now um because after I do this makeup I just need to like focus on work but I'm like where the hell is my trash can like this is freaking me out um because I put it out last night not knowing like it was going to be this windy but like where could it have gone to like did someone steal it like I'm just like really trying not to freak out but I'm freaking out so I'm gonna have to deal with that <laughs> but 
but again I feel like it goes with the this week is cursed for me thing so <clears throat> we'll see what happens there but um yeah I just feel like this weekend is gonna be pretty chaotic but um all good stuff I hope so I'm just thankful you guys are here and um basically we are going to have a good weekend no matter what is going on and we are just going to be grateful for the things that are going well um and yeah so i'm gonna finish up my makeup and do my meeting find my trash can hopefully <laughs> like my life is just so in shambles, I feel like, right now, but I moved out. My room is coming together slowly but surely, um, and yeah, so let's focus on the positive. <laughs> oh my god, you guys, I could legit cry right now. Caitlin door dashed me a dozen Valentine's donuts, or half a dozen, sorry, and an iced coffee from Dunkin'. Oh my god, and I never have, I don't think I've gotten the brownie batter one this year. They're always sold out. Oh my god, and she knows Boston cream is my favorite. <laughs> oh, this was so, so sweet of her, and oh my gosh, this just really, really brightened my day. Yesterday at Target, I finally remembered to get the um, dryer balls. I've been wanting to get them, uh, but I always forget. So you just throw the three in, it comes with three, and you just put them in with your clothes or whatever to dry. And it says that you can add like essential oils even into it, um, like to basically have it be scented, but I'm just going to use them like plain. And so that will, that helps with waste from like the dryer sheets and all that so yay can't wait to use those oh my god you guys happy update i found my trash can okay this is a big deal because i was freaking out all day but i couldn't like do anything about it i was just like so focused i needed to work and not be distracted by my missing trash can so when I left, because I'm driving over to my parents right now, um, I noticed there was like two trash cans in front of this one house. Um, and so I went really slow and thank God my trash can has like our house number on it. So I like could identify it and know for sure that it was ours. So I got it, I put it in the garage, and now I can relax about that at least. And um, yeah, but I was so like trying to get shit done in the zone and then just like emo um, because like the relationship thing. Um, but I didn't even eat lunch and it's four o'clock. Well, I had that donut like pretty late in the morning. So um, I guess that held me over with lots of carbs and sugar. But I feel like I'm mostly like running on adrenaline at this point. And so um, this meal is gonna taste extra good. And I think it's eight courses. Like it's a lot, but they're very small portions. So I'm hoping it will fill me up. And if not, I'll just like get Taco Bell or something afterwards. <laughs> How like horrible is that? This is my outfit of the night. Favorite blazer, black dress, and then I'm wearing my knee-high um, Stuart Weitzman boots, and so it's just like a barely a sliver. <laughs> and I forgot to bring leggings, so this was actually like a good an solution. inspired solution, I would say. <laughs> Let me show Rachel's outfit, because she looks so good. Oh my god, I love <laughs> this dress! So we got it from Nordstrom Rack like a few yeah. years ago. Yeah, and then your combat boots are also from Nordstrom Rack. Mm -hmm. Looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> 
So tonight we're at Bolit for their supper club and I am so beyond excited. They just brought us a little cocktail sip and we're gonna get started on the first course soon. Beet puree, tempura something. Um, braised short rib smells amazing. We've had so many courses, but I forgot to vlog. Very oh soft. yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. Morning, you guys, from the Duncan drive through It is 9.45 and I rushed as fast as I could because I texted Alyssa this morning when I woke up and I was like, can't wait to see you, Rumi. Like, um, good luck with the move. And she was like, thanks, I'm freaking out because the movers came, like, literally they were supposed to come at like 11 or something. They must have come like before nine. That's a big difference and she, I feel so bad for her. Like, I would be freaking out so much. I'm freaking out, like, just because I wanted to, like, get a few things moved in the house before she came. Um, so, um, I am getting Rachel from my parents' house and so I'm getting breakfast for all of us, like I used to, but now I'm like under the gun and just feel way more stressed than I would have. But I'm really glad I set my alarm this morning because I was in such a food coma last night. Like it wasn't even funny. The food was incredible at Bolit. Um, if you're in the Lehigh Valley, check Bolid out for like a special dinner. Um, I treated my family to the supper club, um, one, because I wanted to go, but to thank them so much for everything that they've done um, with my move especially, but just like in life in general. Um, and it really came at a perfect time when I was like so like distressed about my relationship and stuff so i'm feeling better about it but i am also very distracted so that's been helpful <laughs> um but yeah so i'm getting breakfast this line is a little longer than i would like but um hopefully i can get to their house by 10 eat and then get me and rachel back there because my um additional chair was delivered so i have this huge box sitting in our driveway because that's just where the fedex guy put it um and like we have to move the couch oh my gosh there's like a lot that i wanted to do this morning but now it's gonna be a little rush because they're gonna get here to the townhouse around like 11 30 and i'm very worried that they're gonna get there early <laughs> just with how things have been going so yeah I'm a little stressed but um, we're just gonna try to uh, make the best of it and yeah the outcome of today will be great because Alyssa will be moved in it will be hard because it was hard for me to get settled um so it'll be hard for her and mocha to get settled but that's one of the reasons um rachel's coming over we're gonna watch mocha in my bedroom which is in the basement so we can like close the door and stuff because the rest of the house is pretty open so um i know she's gonna be like a little worried and stuff and like confused so like mocha so um we're gonna hopefully make her feel better and uh watch her and stuff like that so anyway i'm almost up so that's good this line is moving pretty quickly so i'll talk to you guys later <laughs> I should have done a before, but we moved all the stuff out of the way in the family room. I have to move my air purifier off to the side, but um, we are ready for the movers to get here. And my basement has some updates as well, but um, just kind of a crazy morning with them uh, showing up earlier and they're on their way now. So, eek! Moki, you're home! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, Alyssa and the movers just got here. And now Moki's checking out everything. 
We got the second chair down here. I need to rearrange some of this because it's a little cramped, but Mocha's just exploring while the movers are bringing in Alyssa's stuff. This is like Rachel's dream. Yeah. Because uh, <laughs> uh, Ryan, Alyssa's brother's dog, is going to be down here too. <laughs> I'm going to get so excited. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, Moak? <laughs> She's like, this is just the place I'm hanging out for the t today, today, right? <laughs> Isn't that the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All of a sudden it started snowing and it's like real crazy. Um, okay, Rachel's getting our food. Be safe out there. I just got a <gasps> you just got a splinter? In the wood here. Where? On your foot? No. Oh my gosh, I never <laughs> don't wear shoes. <laughs> I always wear my Crocs. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, Alyssa! <gasps> And look at this room. I showed it before. You'll have to see it. And then now we're like rearranging. We're going to be building the TV stand. I'm so excited. But first we're having sustenance. And the dogs are here. Kirby's over there. Where's Mocha? Oh my gosh. She's like trapped over there. <laughs> Amazing. Ryan and Rachel are almost done. I never thought of that. Ryan and Rachel. <laughs> They're almost done building this. It's been a pain in their butts, but we, we appreciate it. And now we're drinking champagne straight from the mini bottle. <laughs> We've done a lot, okay? Look at this place. So we have a lot that we still need to put away, but we're making progress, reorganizing. Got lots of plates and everything. Oh, I'm proud of this over here. These um, bins from Target, I put like dish towels and like pot holders and yep. <laughs> How do you feel being on YouTube? <laughs> I guess I'd get used to that. Yes. <laughs> Rach and Ryan finished building this and now we have a big ass TV. This was Alyssa's and then um, she bought the stand from Target. I'll link that down below. It was a pain to install. So just uh, keep that yeah, in mind. Yeah, but it looks great. And these um, are like little cabinets on the side kind of. Um, but yeah, we'll be able to see the TV from the dining room, the kitchen and the family room, which has Mocha's bed. <laughs> Okay, we're popping bubbly. Oh, I shouldn't oh shake God. it. No. I did that accidentally. Break something or first thing. I don't know. Should I do it outside? <laughs> I'm scared. I don't know the proper way to do it. Me neither. I feel like you're supposed to use like a towel. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> you're scared. I'm like maniacally laughing. Cry. Yeah. <laughs> Mocha's just chilling. Oh my god. Please read warning below. <laughs> As if we were scared enough. Oh god. Where? Warning. Oh, it's for like not drinking oh. unless you're like supposed to. <gasps> oh my god. Should I do it outside? Yeah. <laughs> I think we'll be fine. But yeah, you can I'll just put it over here. Okay. Does it pop off as soon as you were like uncaged? I don't think so. <gasps> okay. Oh, oh my god, why is this so might... dangerous? <gasps> oh my god. Okay, you'll be fine. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, wait. Okay, it's Can happening. It? Yeah. glasses for years. Pour on an angle. So the bubbles. Thank you. I was like, there's a technique mm -hmm. and I just throw my way. Oh that's yeah. That's how you do it for beer too. Okay. And cider. Oh my god, that's a lot. Woo! We have to take a picture even though we look horrible. Not you, but no, we, we feel, feel horrible. Greasy. Yeah. <sighs> Cheers! Happy birthday! <laughs> I, can't can't, I know. It's we so made it! Real. Mm. The cheap stuff always tastes better. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even care. Bottom shelf. Oh my god. 
mochas. Feeling at home. <laughs> I'm finally getting ready for bed. Uh, it's after midnight, which is very late for me, but Alyssa and I were watching the new season of Love is Blind, and oh my god, I have so many feelings, you guys. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this show is like such a roller coaster. But um, today was such a crazy day. Like, it felt like the whole weekend, like just in one day. Um, but I'm so thankful we have tomorrow. And obviously, we still have a lot of unpacking and rearranging to do. But I feel like we got the main living spaces at a good spot. Um, and yeah, as I know. It all takes time and I still feel like I need to rearrange this area. I'm gonna work on like just seeing how this area feels the best and Rachel and I still have to build my bookshelves. Um, so anyway, this is a work in progress, but um, <laughs> I'm going to go to bed get some good rest. I'm so glad Alyssa and Mocha moved in and it's our first night of many, many more. <laughs> Look who gave me a wake up call this morning, Moki. <laughs> it's so nice having a dog, right? <laughs> We're watching Love is Blind this morning. We're gonna build a circular plant shelf that we're gonna put up there. Hopefully it's not too complicated. I think it's just big and awkward, but it does look like there's a lot of pieces. So wish us luck. We got one half, you guys. It's just amazing because it was very hard. And if you get this, build like the stairs first and then attach it to the attach these long ones to the base and then attach everything because we had to redo it and now we still have to build this other one but this looks pretty freaking sick we did it you guys this took forever but it turned out really cool and so Alyssa's gonna put her plants on this and it's just a really neat piece um but i am going to read because I'm really enjoying my book and haven't had time to read lately. So I'm about like a third of the way in of Beasts of Extraordinary Circumstance and I can't wait to just relax this afternoon. Alyssa's going over to her parents house for a little bit and I think I mean there's always things that I could do but um, I'm just going to relax for a little bit and try to just decompress. You gonna come up here? Yeah. She likes making like a little nest between your legs. <laughs> it's so sweet. I love having a dog now as a roomie. <laughs> You guys know I just can't sit still, so I've been kind of rearranging some things down here and Rachel's gonna come over to help me build the bookcases that I bought to go there. Um, and I put the other chair that I had over in that corner because it's really nice to have it um, for extra seating, but it does look a little cramped when everything's like, all out so that is what I did for now and let's see what else oh I put one of the baskets there to like hold some odds and ends and I'm gonna get another one to go down there I'm pretty sure um, <laughs> there's just always something you guys but it's really really fun and I'm loving it but yeah I can't wait for Rach to come over because once I have the bookcases, I can bring my books over here, and also I have some like pottery that I want to put probably there or figure out where to put it. So that will help me because that's like the last furniture pieces that I bought for this room. So can't wait to see that all come together. Rach came over and she helped me build this bookshelf. Thank you. Now we just have to do another one, but that'll be another day. And now I can at least start to put 
books in it and then I'm gonna put some decor and stuff but yep that's what we were up to while watching while watching the amazing race I'm running out and doing some returns and pickup orders from Target and Ulta and it's actually a beautiful day me and Alyssa and Mocha took a nice walk at lunch and it's still 56 degrees which is insanity um, so it's still really nice and you can't even see me but um, yeah I don't even need a jacket which is really cool I'm home now I showered I'm ready to go to bed but I really want to put away some books I brought a whole box of books um, from my parents house to put in this bookshelf and these are all books I have not read yet so I'm thinking because we're gonna build another bookshelf of the same one um, I'm thinking this one will be all of my book books that I haven't read and then the other one will be like books that I've read and then at Target I got um, two of these like baskets that I just thought were really pretty and two like smaller faux plants that I thought would like potentially look nice on these shelves so I got this one that's more like leafy and then this one I think is like faux eucalyptus I've just thought both of those were kind of cute and then um, these I'm thinking to put them up here like you could put like flowers or something in them I could even put them on the smaller shelves too but I just like like the texture and just having another natural element and you can also put them this way um, with the size of my shelf so I'm gonna do some book arranging and then head to bed. So here's where I netted out with my books for now. This isn't all of the books <laughs> that I need to bring over, but for now this is how I have them organized. And then these shelves, I really don't have anything on them. Um, and I also got another bin like this um, for more like storage of random stuff and so I just have those there but I'm going to wrap up this vlog here and I hope you guys enjoyed this one and my baby hairs are living their best life again so I hope you guys are all doing really well and I'll see you soon bye